Ladies and gentlemen, welcome yow, yow. back. <laughs> Fuckhead. Ladies and gentlemen, yow. welcome back to the fucking yow, yow. 13th episode of I'm going to shove my microphone up your ass. Ooh, yes, please. <laughs> What's going on, peeps? I'm hyped up today. I've just had a coffee and I'm just hyped up. I don't know why. Yeah, just mate, excited. Made him another coffee. And we've got a new mic as well. So I'm using, using the, new, the new road mic. Just Dude. Do it. I swear to God, I wish we had a camera right now because Jack's off jobs. Yeah, you biz natches. You'd think you went out, not me. Yeah. Oh, well, <laughs> that's yeah. why you're a bit quiet. <laughs> <laughs> quiet? Yeah, like you're not, you know, <laughs> like me. <laughs> <laughs> ah, shouldn't have given me that coffee. I'm hyped up now. <laughs> Having a sugar rush. <laughs> How are you, man? Um. <laughs> What's going on? I'm super, super good, but um, I am tired. I am very, very tired. Um, I went out last night. I went to... Yeah. I went to ABC. Uh, and then I went to Lucky Thursdays. And then after that... What the fuck are you doing? I'm burping, but I don't ah, right. I didn't mic. know... No, because I just saw you looking at me going... No, no, because I had to burp, but I yeah, didn't no, burp feels, into the mic. Yeah, no, it feels... I'm just going to let a burp rip into this mega hand. Yeah, boy. Um, <laughs> good Jesus. Um, <laughs> and then I went to... Uh, uh, rev the car. <laughs> rum, 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 rum. Sorry, that was so fucking cringy. And um, yeah, so I stayed there till close, and uh, that was an interesting ex- experience to be. Yeah. Sitting Doesn't at- it turn into like a restaurant or something? Yeah. Yeah. It's an interesting experience to be sitting in revs uh, on the couch and then and not being able to see anything because you're so fucking drunk. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> yeah, um. <laughs> And then looking out like one of the slits in the windows and going, holy fuck, there's, that's the sun. Yeah, there's light outside. <laughs> and anyway, so yeah, we walked out on the chapel street and I'm thinking, oh no. Fuck me, it's daytime. Yeah. Like, it's daytime. Are you, oh, fuck. Yeah, because I remember he told me he was going out and I looked. She didn't think it was going to be I that woke much. up. I woke up at like nine this morning and I looked at your Snapchat <laughs> and I'm like, oh, okay, he sent me one six hours ago. I'm like, oh. And then at six hours ago, you were still out and I'm like, oh no. And then I'm like, what time did he get home? And then I looked at your story and it was like three hours ago. You were still walking home. I'm like, yep. oh. <laughs> yeah, buddy. So I'm like, ah, oh, today's going to be interesting. <laughs> so uh, Jack asked me uh, how many how many hours sleep did you get? And I said, ah, fun, fun question, funny answer. Uh, technically none, but also technically some. Right. I, <laughs> fuck. We walked to Paran Station and... Um, Print stations on the Sandringham line, I do believe. Yeah, we got we got that to Flinders Street. I was fiending for food. Uh, oh, so you went back to Flinders before you came? Yeah, because yeah. I had to get onto the Frankston line. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, oh, I could get off at like South Air or something, and then just catch the thing. But I want fucking KFC or something. <laughs> yeah, like I was so hungry. <laughs> well, dude, I hadn't had. I haven't eaten. Yeah, uh, I've eaten now. Don't worry. Uh, Good. Concerned about you. Thanks for caring about me. <laughs> Thanks for caring about me, darling. <clears throat> I feel so much safer talking to this mic now. Like, I feel like I'm not going to be like... <laughs> safer? What? Gonna... You feel like no one's going to break into the door and fucking Yeah, I rub feel you. like if I'm talking... <laughs> Did you say rub me? Rob you. Oh. <laughs> I wish I'll rub would... you. I wish come true. <laughs> um, anyway, yeah, so I go to Flinders and I, uh, I'm walking around fucking aimlessly. Like, oh, I'm God. still recovering. And I go to the KFC and they're fucking closed. So I'm like, fucking bullshit. What'd you end up getting? And it's, well, I didn't even get anything. Oh. Yeah. So, so I, and, then I went, and then I went to Macca's and then I looked on their menu and it, like, it was still the breakfast menu. Yeah. I was like, bro, I want a fucking double quarter pound. Oh. I wanted a large double quarter pound of meal and I wanted to get a fucking vanilla thick shake. Yeah. Like, ha <laughs> ha. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. God, this is uh Wait, <laughs> I'm gonna fucking hold on. Do you wanna do it with me? What? We'll put reverb on this. We'll do edit and we'll fix it in post. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. God, this episode is already all over the place. Man, this is crazy. We've got Halo and Revs. Um Halo and Revs. Why does that sound like something? I anyway. Don't know. So yeah, I I, uh, I look at the menu. I could have just gotten nuggets, but I was like, oh fuck that! I want a burger. I was like, oh, burger. I, I've got to get home. So, fuck's sake. So what did you get? You got the El Maco? No, I got nothing. Oh. I went to the train station, tapped on. Was like, fuck me! I hope there's money on this thing. 
uh, <laughs> me out. Like, what the fuck is that? Uh, went to my platform. As I was walking up, the train came. So I was like, mm, kind of fire. Yep. Got on the train. I think we got to like Hawksburn, which is like yeah, yeah, yeah. Four, I know Hawksburn. St- yeah, four yeah. stations out from Flinders. Yeah. And I don't know what happened. I was listening to the basement yard. Shouts out, boys. Um, <laughs> and because uh, I was like, yeah, I'm not listening to music right now. Yeah. Because if I put on music, I'm going to end up listening to like abstract or something. Yeah, Shouts and you're going to get rowdy. Uh, <laughs> and I'm going to be like, oh, my head, my head, my head. Yeah. So I listened to uh, Joe and Danny. Yeah, that's their names. Holy shit. <laughs> I listened to them talking about banging their head on the fucking wall. Yeah. Bang your head on the fucking wall. Yeah. Joe, bang your head on the fucking wall. Listen to that, and then I just passed out. God, I can never so do that I on train. So yeah, well, mm, in my position, <laughs> we might have done that. Ah, so, so then I, uh, I think, uh, well, how much time does it take uh, to get from Hawksburn to Frankston? Yes, I fell asleep and oh, ended up in no, Frankston. You idiot! You idiot! <laughs> so I was meant to get off at Cheltenham, which is uh, thirty minutes from Hawksburn, pretty much. And then Frankston is another, another 30 minutes. Like another 30, yeah. And so <laughs> I, uh, I woke up a little bit and saw Frankston. And I thought it was like my head was so fucked. So I just saw the Frankston sign and, like, and oh, thought, yeah. oh, I'm on the Frankston line. Yeah. This is all good. We're going to move in a second. And I thought, oh, no. And I thought, wait a minute. Where the fuck am I? This does not look familiar at all. Oh, God. And then, like I looked to my right where I used to catch the bus to go to my ex's place. And I was like. Oh, shit. I was like, ah, oh, motherfucker. Yeah, fuck. That was legit the noise I made. I made Scary it out place loud. to be well. at, uh, what was it, like 6 a.m.? <laughs> no, it was about, no, it was about 8 a.m. at this point. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, fuck me. I was meant to be home an hour ago. Well, not meant to be, but it was sort of like I you, you projected, been home I projected my yeah. home arrival at uh, roughly 7 a.m. Yeah. And yeah, I'm sitting down. Of course, one of the things that run through my mind is, oh, well, they've renovated this place quite nicely, but get me the fuck out of here. <laughs> so and you still s- haven't eaten at this point? No, no, I had eggs earlier, but um, shout out, mom. No, like on the train. You oh, should, no, you, I have like, not at eaten. At this point in the story, you no, still haven't eaten. I have not eaten nothing. <laughs> right, okay. And um, and we're sitting at Frankston Station for so long, and I'm like, fuck, is this As if no out? one woke you up. Well, where the fuck were they supposed to know where I was going to get off? They don't know where you live? No, I was with no. I wasn't with anyone. Oh, no. I thought you no, were I was with. No, I was on my own. Right. Well, then um, that makes sense. Yeah. But I thought you were with someone. No, no. So, <laughs> so, I'm like waiting for this train to move, and I'm like, dude, fuck, this thing better go soon. I'm kind of starting to freak out now. Am I stuck in Frankston? I'm like in the worst place to be. I'm dressed like a complete fuckhead. Yeah. As usual. Um. And I'm like, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, and then it starts moving. I'm like, thank fuck. Yeah. Caram Station's not looking too bad. I've never been down that way. Never been down that way? Yeah, save yourself the trouble. <laughs> <laughs> so you had a bit of a uh, early, yeah, so early I ended Christmas up, celebration. Yes, yeah, so I ended up where I didn't really need to fucking go. <laughs> yeah. 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 Early it's my Christmas. Birth, birthday in four days. Yeah, it is. Christmas Eve. Send me fucking presents. Yeah, you got to send him some presents. Yeah, man. Don't uh, not get lost in the mail like mine. Yeah, <laughs> fuck, man. Yeah, so years ago, uh, it was my birthday party and Jack... I lived over the back fence. Jack lived over the back fence. Like, not even an exaggeration, he was over the back fence. We used to chuck shit like that we left at each other's houses yeah. over. Like, oh, bro, I left my fucking laptop charger at yours. Yeah. Why are we all of a sudden Lebo? Yeah, I don't know. You be. Um, chuck it over and so he just chucked the laptop charger over. And then one year when he came for my party, he's like, oh, sorry, I, didn't, I don't have your present with me. You got lost in the mail. And I'm like, what? I'm just like, you live over the back fucking <laughs> fence, you dickhead. <laughs> I was trying to be funny because, you know, I didn't no, you get you a gift. You escaped, fuck. No. Yeah. Hey, I don't think you got me a gift no, that year. that's all right. No, I don't think we were hanging out of that. At your, on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, hang on. Yeah. Uh, what is it actually called? The penal, 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 Nigel or something. I was I thinking know. Nigel. Nigel Thornbury. <laughs> Nigel Thornbury. <laughs> Anyways. It's crazy, son. Yeah. It's um, fucking speaking of Christmas. It's coming up. Yes, it is coming up. It is the season to get. Be jolly. 
It's the most wonderful time for a beer. <laughs> Jack fucking hates I that hate ad. I hate that ad so I much. love it. It's, it is the it's most not, wonderful time for a beer. Horrible. As, as uh, demonstrated by myself yesterday. <laughs> yeah, so. um, well, we have some questions to ask you, Lachlan. You're yeah. in the hot seat right now. Oh, what? Oh, fuck. No, it's not. You know the questions. Oh, right. Don't I thought you had some surprise <laughs> ones. I thought, shit, I was not prepared. No, no. Yeah, so, yeah. We, uh, we, we had this idea. That uh, we would discuss things about Christmas that we enjoyed or yeah, you know, some so, memories or whatever. Yeah, so are we, we going to take turns reading one, one Yeah, we'll go, we'll go one by yeah, one. So our five favourite things about Christmas. All right. Am I, am I starting off? Or I'll go first. You'll go first? Yeah. All right, Jack, what is your first... Are we going from uh, least favourite to most favourite? Just, I'm Christmas? just doing it. You're just doing it? You I'm didn't doing number it. them? No. Go for it. Um, so we were talking about this before actually, but the weather... So I said, oh, like, yeah, I didn't even think of apart that. Apart from like most recent years. Yeah. Like it's usually always pretty, pretty warm on Christmas. Yeah. Like pretty, pretty hot and like just a good, good weather for like, you know, a chill well, home or a barbie. As Australians, we like, like I'm not, we've got like what one US listener <laughs> and two from the UK. Yeah. You guys have here yeah, international. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah, it's the same people each week. Um, They probably just watch. One. Yeah, they're, yeah. Um, <laughs> they're like as bots. as you would know, uh, even if you're not from there, that they have uh, Christmas in winter, which, by the way, g- kind of fire. Yeah, I kind of. I really want to have a white Christmas. Yeah, same. All I need is a missus for that over here. But like, um, <laughs> that's, that's so bad. Um, I don't get it. Oh, <laughs> on, on Christmas. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> yes. Right, right. I get um, it now. C- okay. Carbonara sauce. Mayo. Anyways, yeah. So our, our our um our Christmases are in summer. So having a nice warm Christmas is a fucking essential. Yeah, but the last couple of years has been pretty short. Sure yeah, but yeah. So we're we're praying for a good Christmas. It's day. supposed to be like twenty four, which is not that warm. It's not that warm, but if it's if the sun is out and it's there's clear, no clouds, yeah. if it's clear, if it's clear then it's good. you're gonna get a nice bit of a bit yeah. of a bit of heat, a bit yeah. of yeah. bit of rays. All right, what's yours? All right, I'll go for my first one. Wow, I'm such a cockhead. Uh, <laughs> gifts. <laughs> Yeah, dude, dude, I I just love, and not even like for myself. I actually enjoy like cause watching people get yeah, their I gifts. Actually, yeah, especially when it's something you've gotten for them. Yeah. Oh man, good for uh, Like I don't like when people keep my gifts secret because like I want to know what it is. Yeah. But when I can keep their gifts a secret and they open, they're like, "Oh my god!" You're like, "Yeah." I love <laughs> I love not putting my presents out until like the night on the tree. So no one has any fucking clue I've got them something. Yeah. I'm really sorry, but I haven't fucking actually got anyone anything this year. Uh, sorry, family. I, uh, That's all right. You've just... I am trying to earn money and yeah. switch up. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, but I don't know. I, I think that there's a release of dopamine. Yeah, definitely. So like just seeing other people, but obviously opening your own presence. And yeah, of course. I'm using one of my presents right now, and I'm very <laughs> thankful for that. Do like you, it's do you guys do like a microphone on Christmas this. Day? Do you guys do like someone hands out the presents, or you guys? Just yeah, go, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, someone hands out the presents. Yeah, because that's Fuck what we yeah, do. Dude, as well. you have to like, do we that. We have to. We put like Santa hat on and like we dude, read it out. It's dude, cool. I'm. I think I'm dressing up as Santa this year because oh, yeah. my my little sister is three years old. So yeah, um, she is. Oh, still, so you're gonna put like the full outfit? Yeah, on. bro. Oh, yeah. I don't need to put in the fat stuffing though this year. I've <laughs> already got that. Um, by yeah. the way, ladies and gentlemen, uh, you'll be happy to know that the uh, fit bod has been postponed a year, and the <laughs> dad bod will be will be will be will be sticking around for the remainder of um, the first half of 2020, and uh, that's all right. Probably the rest of my fucking life. I'm a fat cunt. Uh, so yes, uh, yeah, I'll, we're going to be handing out presents, which is going to be kind of fire. Cool. I cool. cannot wait because there are a lot around the Christmas tree. I looked under my tree the other day, looking for any for me. None under there. Oh, really? Yeah, not, not oh. too happy about that one. <laughs> Fuck. I do. You you know my habits. Yeah. You know my habits. Look, I've stopped looking now. So. Look, like, as much as I've roasted you already for, like, looking under and, like, shaking your presents and shit yeah. and feeling them. I'm glad I didn't shake a certain present. <laughs> I don't, um, I don't, like, shake them or, like, feel them. I just go under there and look like at all the presents. I'm like, oh, this one's for blah, blah, blah. I wonder what it is. Like, I like yeah. it. Dude, I, I even feel other people's presents. I'm like, I know what the fuck that is because I know what's on their Christmas list. Yeah. Like, oh man, I'm so, 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 so. I mean, I actually, they know that I know what this present is. So I'm so keen for the fucking ping pong table. Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be fire. We're going to have some mad sessions. 
it's going to give us something other uh, other to do than uh, fucking playing on the Xbox. True, true, true. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, so my second one is going to be very different to yours, but oh, fuck, uh, okay. It's the cricket, mat. The cricket. Every yeah, year. you know what? It's essential. I'm, I'm going to agree with you on this because I remember last year I went to my first test match and I actually enjoyed it. The funny thing was though, that was probably the worst, the most I, boring test I match know. I've been to. <laughs> I know. <laughs> um, yeah, but cricket, like not even Boxing Day, just cricket on Christmas, like backyard yeah. cricket. Dude. Oh, mate, you can't beat it. All backyard the fans beach there. Cricket. Oh, mate. Dude. All the fans there. How good was beach cricket after we finished year 12? Oh, I know, right? We, we went to the beach. We got some drinks. Um, I think we got Subway as well. That's right. the story for another time, yeah, bro. We're just time. focused on Christmas right now. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, but cricket yeah, is stuff. essential for me. Got to have, got to have the backyard cricket there, and also you know the Boxing Day test the next day. Am I on to my second one? Yeah, yeah. I'm on to my second one. Mm-hmm. Family. See, for me, a lot of my and I, for you as well, like a lot of my family is is so spread out. Like I've got yeah. my uncles in Japan. Uh, I've got family in India. Um, Yes. Uh, I've got family in Adelaide. My dad's in Adelaide. Um, mm-hmm. People on the Gold Coast, people in Sydney, people in Tassie. So when it comes to Christmas... Um, Fuck, I was meant to be going to the Gold Coast tomorrow. Shit. <laughs> Fuck my life. <laughs> yep. The sacrifices you make for a, for a job, people. I'm going. Soon. <laughs> Suck my d- d- dick. <laughs> so I've gone to Hawaii next year. I'm, I'm yeah. chilling with that. Um, Hawaii's good, man. I'm I'm so keen. Um. Anyway, for another time. Yeah, we'll um, talk about another time. <laughs> uh, so being able to sort of go somewhere, have you know Christmas Day, with your family, especially family that you don't see, like when I had my whole family come up like a few years ago, it was just nice because I think as I've gotten older, I've sort of really appreciated those relationships a lot more because those are the people who are fucking closest to me, no matter how far they are, distance wise. And, uh, yeah, I, I do really, really appreciate family. And although uh, we don't have many family members up here this Christmas, I think it would be nice to have a bit more of a laid-back one this yeah. year because the last few years have been fucking hectic. Yeah, like, yeah. like last year was my 18th, so we had the whole fucking... Fam. Up, yeah, down at one point. The whole point. clan. It was fucking... Yeah. Ooh, yak? Yak? <laughs> yeah, yak. What's, on your, what's the third on your list? Um... <laughs> I actually did something similar. I did like the mood of Christmas yeah, day because the mood's always like Dude, good on Christmas you day. You cannot fuck the mood on Christmas day. Even when mum's like stressing, stressing about the food and shit. Dude, you just mm. stay out of her way. Just do whatever Dude, she asks. Mum's stressing about food on Christmas day. You get the fuck out of the kitchen. Yeah, you just. And then if she asks you to set the table or you do You set something, the fucking you do table. Whatever, yeah, you do it. <laughs> you ask you to fucking massage her foot because you fucking been standing up doing. Fucking cooking all day. You massage the fucking foot. Yeah. With gloves. <laughs> you know, you just want to get, you don't want to get like fungal infection. Yeah. Fungal. I also had gifts on mine as well because, you know. Yeah. It's, it's Christmas. Might as well just, you it's might as well just tell me that because of we've already said it. Christmas. Yeah, dude. Like. Oh. Dude, I remember when I was a kid, right? Mm. I'm sure every kid's done this. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But I used to wake up. I like think you'll like my next one, by the seven, way. Seven. It was like. Dude, me, you'd get up so my, fucking me, early, Me man. and my sister oh, would go down. We'd go to the tree and just look at all the presents under. Dude. And we'd literally sit there and wait for like two hours until everyone got up. Oh, you'd wait? Bro, I wouldn't fucking woke everyone. I'd be like, come on, come on, come on. It's Christmas, it's Christmas, it's Christmas. I remember one year I got this. Do you remember Bionicles? Oh, mate. Dude, there was this like a mechanical series. It was a giant like ship, like a spaceship. It was like from here to there. It was like a solid like two feet long and it was this high. You twist this shit and these fucking guns rotate. It took me the whole day to build. Yeah. It was fucked. And it was the coolest thing I'd ever fucking gotten. And I was fucking so gassed to get it. Yeah. <laughs> Although I... Um, you already knew that you had it? No, no, no. Oh. no. Uh, <laughs> I was going to say, oh, I heard you. No, that came years after. <laughs> do you know... How, oh, I'm going to ask you this after we do this okay. because I think I think it's an interesting thing to do. But I'll, I'll, uh, I'll go with my next one. And uh, everyone fucking loves these. They're corny. What's inside them is cringy. Oh, Fun to bon wear. Bonds. Fucking ripping the bonbons. Yeah, yeah. Dude. And yeah. then the I, funny I thing, have a technique for it. No one thing, ever fucking wins against me because I'm like, I know where to grab. <laughs> the funny thing about the jokes in the bonbons is they that. They're fucking so bad. But they're my jokes. Like, yeah, I tell jokes Jack that are bad. Jack makes those jokes so. like. 
Uh, Jack, would you like to quickly tell them the dark arts joke? Uh, they can have that another time. Oh, fucking hell. It's bad. Yeah. I'll just tell you that bad. much. We'll, uh, we'll... But like ripping the bonbons, else. getting your little crown, putting the crown on. Yeah, mate, yeah. Mate. Putting together that fucking whatever the fuck toy. The toy, yeah. In, in there. Sometimes those toys are actually pretty handy. S- but most of the time they're, they're pretty shit. They're pretty shit, yeah. <laughs> I just, uh, I kind of, t- it sounds so bad. I kind of take joy in winning against the kids because they start fucking whinging about it. And I'm like, ah, sucked in, motherfucker. You better learn for next year. Huh? Where to grab cynical, that mate. shit. Yeah, I know. <laughs> What's your next one? Is this your fifth one now? Yeah. Um, I just said Christmas Eve in general because I love you. Me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, no, I just love like... Roughly 9.32 p.m. is like the best time or... <laughs> That's when I was born. Um, no, I can't. Just letting out all my birth details right now. I can't sleep on Christmas Eve because there's always just the anticipation of. Fuck! I slept pretty well last year. I was fucking hammered because of my eighteen. <laughs> yeah. Wait. Was, did you actually have your party on? Uh, we we went out. Yeah. We went to this Eve. restaurant called Lucy Lou. Oh, in the no, city. No, that was like, that was a month like later. The oh one, yeah, the no. One we had, yeah. yeah, that was cool though. I liked that night. That was on the twenty eighth. Anyways, fire. what's your next one? Um, the Christmas tree. Oh. Every year I take so much. See, fucking someone said to me the other day because of the Christmas in November episode. Yeah. Someone was like, dude, why the fuck you hating on Christmas? I, I'm like, dude, I don't hate Christmas. I hate people putting up fucking decorations in November. Yeah. If you're planning like one of those mad fucking Psytrance uh, light shows on your house. Yeah. Go for it. That's going to be sick. Yeah. That's going to be sick. And I'm going to go and watch it. And I'm going to go fucking cream myself at the front of your house. <laughs> Probably not to that extent. But like, if you're just putting up your fucking Santa, don't put up your fucking Santa. I've got my inflatable Santa up the front. Yeah, we don't have any decorations. I've got a couple fucking, I don't know why we got these, but we got these like light up pelicans. <laughs> yeah, whatever. We've got some uh, candy canes at the back. Don't know why they're at the back. Um, but yeah, I don't hate Christmas. As you can tell, I actually fucking love Christmas. I just hate it's my it when favorite time. Celebrate too early. Yeah, I just don't like when people celebrate too early. Or when they like push it on you, they're like, "Oh, it's Christmas. Why aren't you happy?" You're like, it's like "Dude, because I'm having me a, a shit g- day." <laughs> give me, give me a sec. I'm like, I'm. This is what people don't realize. The run up to Christmas, the 24 days to Christmas, including my birthday. Like my birthday is one of the most stressful days of the year, but I still love it. Yeah. You are working your ass off to try and get money to buy people presents, or just to fucking survive in general. Mm-hmm. You're probably finishing up. You were finishing off uni. Yeah. Um, I'm just nonstop working. I'm trying to get a bunch of other shit sorted. There's people enrolling in courses. There's parents who are still working through to like the fucking 20th. Yeah. Oh, right. We're on the fucking 20th today. Um, it's, it is a stressful time, but it is a wonderful time as well. Once you get to it, it's fucking worth it. Mm-hmm. And putting up that Christmas tree on the 1st of December... Yep. Not that I put up on the 1st of December. I had to wait a couple because the parentals were away. Yeah. Mum. Yeah. I uh, I took all of the decorations off the tree and redid it because I was like, well, the kids couldn't do this shit. Yeah, mum. you told me about that. Mum got new tinsel. So That's I'm what like, my mum does. Like, we'll, She'd be like, oh, put these all on the tree. We put them all on the tree the next day. It, they're different. You're they're like, different. You're um, like, okay, why did you even ask us to do it then? Yeah, <laughs> you just fucking do it, mum. Yeah. But... I must you to do something around Christmas time. Just do, it, do just it. do it. Just, <laughs> just, just fucking do, do it. it. <laughs> just do it. Um, well, you're getting you, some coal. You've gone through your your five because we had one similar one. Yeah. My last one is the food, but um, we also had something else prepared for this. Um, yeah, we, had, we were going to uh, go through and talk about our favorite food. Yeah, our, Christmas our, day. Our top five favorite Christmas day foods. Yeah. You, you put meals here, but I feel like there's only really one meal, so we'll just do foods. Yeah, yeah, I, 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 I was meant to say it was just food. Food, yeah, all. cool, cool. Yeah. So for my first one, I've got the ham, hammy boy. Yeah, I've got ham on mine. Yeah. I've got ham on mine. The ha- Christmas ham. Are you gonna do? We this year we're doing that crackling ham. Have you seen pork that? crackling? No, no, it's like pork crackling, but on the Christmas ham. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Are you gonna be doing that? Um, I don't know if we're gonna be doing that as such, but I know we are going to have a ham and we are going to have crackling. Yeah, but just separate. Because usually because, we have the pork oh. and the crackling and all that stuff. But if we can just do the ham and the crackling, yeah, on the one thing, then yeah. we're just gonna go. But I mean, we checked the other day. Guess how much they are? How much? Hundred bucks. Ah, fuck. Yeah, yeah, that's a lot. How? Dude, Christmas food is actually really expensive. If you want to get a good ham, good turkey, whatever the fuck you want to do, if you celebrate, no, fucking Thanksgiving. 
I really want to be in America for Thanksgiving. I feel like that'd be a really cool experience. Yeah. Have someone baste a fucking turkey. True, true. Boof the turkey. Um, <laughs> you you do any boofing last night? No. No, no, no. <laughs> anyway, yeah. Oh, Shout out to Basement Yard. If you guys don't know what boofing is, check out this week's episode. <laughs> fucking hell, man. <laughs> um, yeah, dude, Christmas ham. Like when you, when you, before it's cooked, it's got a little string around it. Mm. Oh, and it looks, looks like every chick out on... In, in Melbourne on a weekend. The only the bad nets. thing about Christmas ham is <laughs> the months that you eat it afterwards, the leftovers that you have. Dude, leftovers. You eat Christmas ham for about up. fucking three months. Obviously, that's an exaggeration. It goes bad after about a month, but I'm just saying. Yeah, we don't eat it after that. <laughs> um, yeah, so I had crackling on there as well. Yeah. I had. Dude, I had pork crackling on mine too. <laughs> I had candy canes. Dude, I forgot about candy canes. I love candy canes. Candy canes taste mad. I love... Suck, they have a very weirdly distinct... Point. So yes! Like with them. Get over here, motherfucker. Yeah, I love doing that. Is that a good stabbing sound? Sting. 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 Ah, sting. Sting. Uh, all right, I'm going to say my next one. It actually relates off... Um, Candy cane? To ham. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't actually think anyone else would ever have had this. Well, that's going a bit too far yeah, because yeah, like there are yeah. fucking eight... Pretty much 8 billion people on the planet. Yeah. So calm down, Lachlan. But my um, my pop's uh, partner, she's not my nana, but she's sort of like a step-nana. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Denise. Mm-hmm. She, like, it's so simple. It is so simple. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm going to uh, let out my insights. Fucking Boxing Day. And every day after that, that we were in Tassie, mm-hmm. she would chop up Christmas ham into little cubes. Put them on like a platter? Make mac and cheese and mix it through. Oh, yeah. Dude, it is. And I put it on there because that's like sort of a memorable meal for me because I used to have that all the time. Yeah. And I, ha- and I never have it anywhere else and I refuse to because it's just always perfect when she, ha- when she makes it. Yeah. It's so good, man. Oh. Um, oh. Do you have another one? Uh, yeah, I had trifle. Yeah. I can't remember the last time I had trifle. When it's done well, it's good. Yeah. When it's I know I know that much. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Unless you make it like Rachel does in Friends. Yeah. I, mean, uh, I also uh, although had, unless you're Joey. Yeah. Because he just fucking eats everything. I also Me. had um, every Christmas day for the last like four or five years we've done breakfast, and we have like egg bacon and hash brown rolls. Oh, dude. Every Christmas day morning. Hash browns are fire. Oh, amazing. Uh, last on mine. Pavlova. Oh. Yeah. I can't that's I right, baby. Pav. Dude, Pavlova, you got little fucking passion fruit seeds on the top. Yeah, you got your kiwi man. fruit. Pav. Fuck. I said to mum, she was like, what do you want on Christmas Day? Like, because she was asking everyone, like, oh, what are we going to have around the table? Yeah. yeah. First thing I said, I was like, yo, Pav. fucking Pavlova. Have Pav, yeah. Dude, gotta have Pav. Pavy. It's such, it's such an Aussie thing, I feel. Yeah. Like, I know it's in other places, but I feel like that's a Christmas Day staple for Aussies. Pav. There's got to be a fucking pavlova. <gasps> Just any big celebration in Australia. It's Dude, have pavlova. Gotta have a fucking pav. <laughs> oh, I've got a, um, one of mum's friends makes the nicest pav. And every time she comes over, I'm like, She built a pav and I'm in love with the pav. Suck my ass. <gasps> yeah, dude, pavs are fucking fire. Now, I was going to say to you earlier, yeah. um, really hope no uh, children are listening. Uh, if oh, so, no. um, turn it off. <laughs> yeah, if so, turn it off, but also keep it on, but just stop listening because we're swearing way too much for you to be fucking listening. Fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> Plus, yeah, if your kids are listening to this guy, <laughs> penis. This is the child friendly section. <laughs> Even though I just said penis. Sing, dang, dong, ding, dang. I don't know what the fuck we're doing. Um, now I was going to ask you when did, when and how did you find out about it? The, the old Santa not being oh, real. I really hope there's an adult that watches this that is so naive that they're just like, what? Old Saint Nick. Yeah, old fucking Saint uh, Nico- da- Nicolas. Daddy Christmas. Um, yeah, Faja. Faja Christmas. I don't actually think like there was a specific moment I found out. It was just kind of like, oh, it's, you know, this is how it is kind of uh. thing. It wasn't like, oh, mum and dad sat me down and they're like, Look, Santa's not real. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't get that either. It was like I oh. just figured it out. Yeah, I was just like, I'm getting too old for this shit now. <laughs> and mum and dad are like, because my mum and dad still do like, oh, 
from Santa. Kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. It's it's a nice sentiment. Yeah, you know, it's a it's. I fucking love Christmas, man. Yeah, Christmas <gasps> is good. Oh, Christmas what about is yourself? Fire. You didn't have like a. That was so funny. Uh, Dad got me this fucking. Like, if you remember that old red lightsaber I had where you push the button and the blade would fucking spring yeah, yeah, pop yeah. out of it? It's the fucking coolest thing. Like, yeah. it had the motion sounds. Yeah. Yeah. Do, do, fucking sting, sting. Um, fire as fuck. You know, I looked at the wrapping paper on that and I looked you on the wrapping. In the room? I looked at the wrapping paper on my Santa present. And as I was sort of piecing oh, this together, Dad goes, mistake. Dad goes, Oh, oh, look, me and Santa is the same wrapping paper. And then I was sort of like, huh. Taking him on, I'm like eight, eight at the moment. I'm like, huh, huh, okay. Right. <laughs> uh. And then I, uh, one day when we were in Tassie, I, uh, it was the year where my snooping for the presents started. Right, right. And I came out and saw... Them putting it under the tree? Yeah. Yeah. I don't even think they know that because I saw it and went, uh. Did you go back to your room and cry? No, I just went back to my room and went, <laughs> fucking knew it. <laughs> yeah. No, seriously though. Like I wasn't emotional about that sort of stuff. Yeah. Like, did you get, did you get any emotional about any of that sort of stuff? Like Easter Bunny and all nah, that shit? No, nah. Did you ever do the, um, like, oh, put the shit out for Santa? On Christmas night, like cookies or milk or whatever. Yeah, I used to go out and eat it. <laughs> <laughs> I think we did like some. Sometimes we did cookies. Sometimes we just did like carrots. Uh, I um, I remember the yeah for the reindeer. I I remember uh, just like for a couple of weeks ago <laughs> talking to the kids because uh, my two older siblings they they know, you know, and I was like yeah if you want to leave something out for Santa, um he's a does like a good old three to seven hours in a tattoo, um. <laughs> If you want to leave someone out for Santa, he apparently really loves large double quarter pounder meals <laughs> with a vanilla thick shake. But you've got to put it out like... You're fucking copying the hint here, everyone. If you ever want to send me something, send me a large double quarter pounder meal with a fucking vanilla thick shake. Yeah. Yeah. If you ever see me out, that's what you get me. All right? Because I'm so famous that that would totally ever happen. Yeah. <laughs> no, I've got to get the KF, mate. Yeah. Or oh, that, yeah. The Colonel. The Colonel. Oh, here, um, I hear... Santa loves a bit of Kentucky fried chicken. I heard he likes a large zinger stacker box. Yeah, yeah, large zinger stacker box with a, a raspberry Dew. freeze. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's just what I heard. Yeah, like I, I, I just, I'm good mates with him. Yeah, yeah, I just heard of through like mutual friends. Yeah, I'm, you good, know? I'm good mates with him. Speak to him every year. Yeah. Yeah, like once a year, he comes around. And he fucking flies over the house. He's going, "Hey, going? Oh, how did you ever see? How are you, cunt? Did your parents ever <laughs> use that um that website? Which was the what, Santa what? Tracker one? Oh, for fuck's sake! And they always, dude. I I always watched the fucking, and this didn't help, by the way. I always watched on like Sunrise when they would show like Santa flying around like the different cities, yeah. and it was just like a photo of like Sydney at like the Sydney Harbour Bridge and yeah, yeah. the Opera House, and then they'd just have a little fucking shooting star. Yeah, and I'm like, oh yeah, that's fucking Santa. No, but there was this website, it's like <laughs> Santa Tracker, and it literally like around has, the world. Yeah, it's pretty cool. <sighs> It's cool, but like it, that's the sort of shit. Like, I feel like when I was a lot younger, not so much now because I'm retarded. Um, <laughs> that you'd believe? Or no, you, I feel like when I was believe. younger, like, I, that sort of shit to me, like, was so easy to pick out. Yeah. Like, I was a lot more sort of logical. Yeah. Like, I'm logical now, but it's more like. Yeah. <laughs> no. Well, fucking, how the fuck are you tracking Santa? Yeah. You got an FBI agent fucking. <laughs> little fucking tracker on who was. <laughs> Mate, the Mandalorian. Oh, maybe that's maybe that's why Rudolph's red. Fuck my. That's what's inside his red nose. Yeah, maybe tracker. that's why it's red. Maybe that's why he's got such a big red nose. It was on your phone. <laughs> Is that pound? No, it wasn't. That. Was that pound? Nah. No, it wasn't pound. Nah. It's just a secret business. Ah, my battery's on sixty nine. Hey. Hey, so it was pound. No. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, baby. Okay. All right. So I'm putting you in the hot seat answering. You're going to answer some questions for me about Christmas? Christmas trivia. Let's go. Okay. This first one is so easy. If you don't get this, I'm going to be disappointed. What did the other reindeer not let Rudolph do because of his shiny red nose? Uh, wasn't it like something about the fucking... I don't even remember like this song, though. 
just... He wasn't allowed to, like, the barn or some shit, or he wasn't allowed to fucking pull the sleigh. Oh, uh, you're a disappointment. It's joining any reindeer games. Oh, that's right, yeah. <sighs> I don't remember the fucking songs, man. I'm not a fan of Christmas okay, carols. You should, you should uh, find this one. Fuck, I could Being a listening. Catholic boy. <laughs> Where was baby Jesus born? Nazareth. It doesn't say Nazareth on here. Jesus Christ, Nazareth. Where's yeah. it Jerusalem? No. <laughs> it's, it's not what it says on here. Bethlehem. Is that a fucking ham pun? <laughs> Bethlehem. Bethlehem. Is, what am I thinking of? Jesus. Oh, fuck me. It's fucking knocked my pop well, filter. It's probably it like, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. It's Nazareth? probably like... Pretty sure it's Nazareth. Well, it says Bethlehem. Oh, you know what? Fuck that. It's Nazareth to me. <laughs> Next one. Wow, that's gonna. We're gonna cop some heat on on the internet about that. They'll be like, "You guys went to a Catholic school. You don't even know." Yeah, because I didn't listen in fucking religion. Okay, in Home Alone, where the, where were the McAllisters going to leave on vacation when they left Kevin behind? I don't know. I don't like those movies. Goodbye. <laughs> He's left. <laughs> I've just never been a big fan of those movies. Okay, shut up. I don't want to hear it. Okay, uh, Dude, next one. Just... It was Paris. I can't believe you don't like Home Alone. That's gonna. This that was the first time I've ever walked out on the show. Okay, um, in the classic How the Grinch Stole Christmas, you probably don't like this movie either. Fuck, the, you don't have to yell in the mic. The Grinch you was clipping, described clipping your dickhead. With three words, what are they? I don't even know this question. Yeah, so. I don't even know this question. Stink, stank, stunk. <laughs> <laughs> That's it, I'm not going. No, I like that movie. Okay, good. But I just don't remember any details about it. Okay. Um, Man, I'm fucking terrible at this. Yeah. Which Hollywood actor played six different roles in the Polar Express? Oh, what? Probably yeah. Tom Hanks. Hey, yeah, fuck yeah, my hey. boy Tom Hanks. That is a fire movie. Okay, which... Country- That's a fire movie. Yeah, I do like Polar Express. Mad movie, yeah. You guys want to hear Sicko Mode or Mo Mo Bamba? (laughs) You guys want to hear Sicko Mode or Mo Bamba? Uh, Sicko Mode or Mo Bamba? Um, which Christmas? No, which Christmas? Which country did eggnog come from? Oh, uh, probably. I'd like to think the US because apparently the other name for it is Milk Punch. But then I'm thinking about this, and it's. Is it because I? I'd no, no, no. My head that you... No, no, no. Like, I, I'd like to think it comes from, from the US just because it's it, it seems like a pretty fatty drink. Mm. Yes, I'm generalizing Americans right now. Sorry. Um, I feel like it could be a European thing. Pick, Going from Europe. One. Europe. Somewhere in Europe. Well, it asked for a country, but... I don't fucking know the country. England. England, yeah. <laughs> That's that's the one. I was going to say London and then I was about to be embarrassed because that's the city. England is my city. London is my country. <laughs> England is my continent. Okay. <sighs> I'm not going to do any uh, uh, carol ones because you don't like Christmas carols. Well, I know some of them. Um, which country started the tradition of putting up a Christmas tree? Really like uh, Norwegian. No- Norwegian. <laughs> no, uh, Norway. Norway, that's right. <laughs> no, you're wrong. It's Germany. Oh, Fuck. It's kind of in, I was kind of, kind of in a similar region. Okay, have you seen the nightmare before? Nine, Christmas? put up the tree! Put up the tree! Put the bulbs on! Put the star on! Nine! Sorry, that's so fucking mean. Uh, what? Have you seen the nightmare before Christmas? Yes. What a fire movie. Okay, what's the name of the main villain? The oh, uh, isn't it like Oogie Boogie or some shit? Yeah. There we go. All right, how much time? Dude, he's we a funky dude. Oh, we got like six minutes. Yeah, I'll just rush through these. What's the highest grossing Christmas film of all time? Probably Home Alone. Yeah. Yeah. Um, hmm. Merry Christmas, little fella. How many we gifts? We know you're in there. How many? And that you're all alone. Sorry. No, it's all right. How many gifts? See, I know that. In total were given in the 12 days of Christmas song. Oh, fuck me in the ass. <laughs> it's, it's, I don't even get this. It's so confusing. I don't know. It's probably like, doesn't it go up in one like every single day or some shit? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fuck. So... Yeah, I'm not good at math. Um, Dude, you're going to be so confused by this answer and I can't even give you the definition of the answer. Yeah, can I get a calculator? Um, I can't even like, give you that. Probably like 52. No, it's uh, 364. 
How? <laughs> makes no fucking sense. That makes absolutely no sense. Whoever wrote that song's a dickhead. How do you say <laughs> Merry Christmas in Spanish? Oh, oh Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. <laughs> Feliz Navidad. <laughs> Feliz Navidad, Don't Feliz Navidad. Oh, what a fucking banger. Yo, I'll play that. That's the Christmas carol that's going on this fucking holiday season. Um, Should we outro music with Feliz Navidad? Hell yeah. Fuck yeah, cool. Get ready for that. What, uh, <laughs> what was the first company that used Santa Claus in advertising? Uh, the scumbag company. Scumbag. Think of like the biggest company in the world. Uh Apple? No. no um, like before Apple. Fuck, 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 fuck. Probably, uh, how long has Walmart been around? <laughs> no, nah, not Walmart. Um, Target or something. Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Um, have you seen... Uh, I was thinking clothing brands for some reason. Have you seen Elf? Isn't that the one with uh, Will, Ferrell? Will Ferrell? Yeah. I can't remember. Oh, I fucking like barely movie? remember. What? Oh, do you like that movie? Yeah, it's fucking... Okay, oh, that's a fucking if, banger of a movie. I was going to say, if you did Dude, if you didn't oh, like that movie, man. That, that be, Are you I kidding me? Oh, um, what, you know, this is a good Christmas movie. What? Die Hard. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> Have you actually seen Die Hard? I haven't, no. It is a fire movie. We, you must watch that. We are done. You done? Questions. Done? Yeah. How, how many do you reckon I got right out of... Uh, oh, I don't know. We'll have to, what's my percentage, we'll, you reckon? We'll have to edit it and once you edit it, we'll go back and have a look at how many you got right. We'll post it on the story. Yeah. Fuck me. I was terrible at that. The first, actually the first part, the first few I was pretty shit at. And then I sort of started to, you know, pick it up a little bit, you know. Started to pick it up, you know, a little bit, you know, you know, should, should I stick it in? <laughs> okay. What would you say? Last thing. Yeah. Best Christmas movie, worst Christmas movie. Oh, fuck. Um, oh, it's not... See, I it's don't it's not yeah. Neither do I, and that's why I. I can rank my best, but I don't know if I can rank a worse one. I uh, oh, fuck man. Look up up there. I can't decide, and I know that it's. Well, what not, about like top three best? I know that I know that it's not fully a Christmas movie, but there is a lovely Christmas part, a photo that we must repost forever. In Step Brothers. Oh yeah. Yeah man. Fuck no. Oh, I forgot to ask. You like guacamole? <laughs> What the fuck was that noise? Yeah, I'm going to put Step Brothers there, even though it's not fully a Christmas movie, but there's something about Christmas in it and it's a fucking banger of a movie. Um, <laughs> fucking sleepwalking. Um, I'm going to... Oh, man. I'm going to put A Nightmare Before Christmas. That's a fire movie. Jack Skellington. Yeah, I just like him because he Dude. has a pretty much the same name as me. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Shelton and Skelling- Skellington. Skellington. <laughs> I'm here for Christmas, Step Brothers. Fuck. Oh, I don't know, like, many good Christmas movies. Yeah, either. Because, like, I'm not big on the Christmas movie thing. I'm not big on listening to the carols too much. Unless it's for least Navy Dad, you know. Or Silent Night or something like that. Silent Night's, like, dude, my dad used to sing Silent Night to me before bed. I think it's Navy Dad. Feliz Navidad A vero no felicidad I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas From the bottom of my heart Wow Yeah Alright, what about carols then? If you can't think of movies So much more attractive to me right there Yeah What about um Yeah, my favourite Christmas carol Like I don't hate them all. It's just when they're played on repeat. That's when they start to shit me. Uh, I reckon my favourite Christmas carol, fucking Jingle Bells, man. Feliz Navidad has got to be up there. Feliz Navidad is coming in second. Yeah. It's Jingle, Bell in, Jingle Bells in first because it's just like a classic. It's a classic. Jingle Bells. And there's so many spin-offs. Yeah. Oh, man. Ready? You ready for mine? Yeah. Feliz Navidad, banger. Um... I like Silent Night. It's pretty good. Yeah, Silent Night's there for me just because memories. And a sleeper pick. Frosty the snowman has a jolly happy soul. Yeah, yeah. Fuck, With I haven't heard that for so long, and man. a button nose and two eyes made out of coal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dude, the hype on that Banger. is Banger. Tune.
All right. Well, uh, yeah, we've hit the hit the forty five minute mark. We're gonna wrap it up here. Jack, would you uh, you have, you want to plug yourself? Yeah, you can follow me on Instagram at jack.shelt and on Twitter at jackshelton00 because someone else's name is Jack Shelton, apparently. That's right. What about That's yourself? Right. Where can they find you, man? Uh, y'all can find me on Instagram at lockie.howl. That's L-E-C-H-Y. H-O-W-E-L-L. And on Twitter at Lockie Howl. Uh, the links for our socials will be in the description. And you can also find the socials for the show on Instagram at the Icebreaker Podcasts. And on Twitter at Icebreaker Potty. I'm not going to say it again because I say it every fucking episode, but there's another problem. Uh, and on Facebook at the Icebreaker Podcast, the links for these will be in the description. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Or as someone I used to know says, subscribble, which kind of killed me. Don't know why I even mentioned it. Hit that notification icon so you don't miss any releases and make sure to follow the SoundCloud if you're listening from there. Cool. Yeah, good shit. Um, One more thing yeah. we wanted to tell you guys. Um, we're actually going to be taking a break over the Christmas... Slash New Year's sort New of Year's period. Yeah, so... We, work, um, we won't be recording a podcast next week. Yeah, so um, that meaning that there there will be a... One coming obvious, out on... Obviously a 27th episode because that's when you'll be listening to this, but there will not be a 3rd of uh, January episode. So, um, But if you keep... A look out on our socials. You, yes, you might, might be able to find some interesting, some content. other content on there. So yeah, wink, yeah. wink. Yeah, keep keep, keep looking. Um, we'll keep you guys posted. But yeah, this is so weird. This is our last episode for 2019. And before you guys come at us and go Ooh, in the announcement video, you said you'd be recording <laughs> one for the rest of your life. Well, it was a joke. Did yeah. you not see the zoom in on my head? Yeah. Um, Plus, I think the last thing you guys want to be doing around Christmas time is, is listening, listening to us. To us so. Fucking ramble on about. Yeah. So I can But uh, yeah, keep keep posted. Um we will be yeah. posting some other content we've got, on our we've, socials. We've got big plans for next year. Um I so, don't know if, uh, I don't know if I want to hint at something now, but we'll, we'll uh, wait. We can hint it on yeah, yeah. Just next year. Keep your eyes peeled. It's gonna be it's gonna be a great year and I think um I think it's really gonna start to take off for us and I'm pretty excited to see Me too. Where the gonna be fun. future takes us. Yeah, mate. All right, thanks for listening to episode 13, 13. 13 of The Icebreaker, mm. ladies and gentlemen. It's an unlucky number in some cultures. Um, well, that culture can suck my now tag. <laughs> All right, thanks for listening, guys. See you next year, guys. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Merry and, Chris um, Mill. Merry uh, Chris Merry Chris Mizzle, my nizzle. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Are there any other holidays nope. during in that time? Happy Boxing Day? Happy New Year. <laughs> Happy New Year. Merry Christmas Eve. Happy birthday to me. Yep. Some of my motherfucking timeline. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See you guys. <laughs> see you next year. Have a good time. Get uh, get a... Be safe, please. Yeah, we be, want you guys to yeah, return. Man. Be safe. Yeah. All two we, of our listeners. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> it's not because we want you guys to actually be safe. We just need viewers. So. Yeah, man. <laughs> Stay safe. <laughs> Stay safe, but... Be safe. Get crunk. <laughs> Yeah, I will never say get crunk again. Get crunk, <coughs> crunky, drunky, crinky, cranky, drunky, drinky, janky. Yeah, oh yeah, boy. All right, thanks for tuning yeah, in, guys. Yeah, balls. <laughs> <laughs>